Oh my god, finally. All five bolts are in and set with resin. Should have been such a simple job. Just with how hard it was to drill and the weather has taken quite a while, but they're in. So each of these pins is in the wall at least 50 centimeters. So that's like two thirds of the way through the wall. They're super thick, they're 22 millimeters. So once they're set, I can put the bolt and the knot on, put some thread lock on so the bolt doesn't untwist itself, fill behind it and we're ready to go to put the floor joists in. What a mission. So, this is actually a special type of plaster adhesive. So it's not lime, it's not cement, it's like a, I don't know, it's like a really sticky, hard setting plaster. It's what's used, you see it a lot in the old buildings, like every time they want to put an anchor point into a stone wall, they use this stuff. So it's gonna mean it sticks to the stone, not really the I-beam, so the I-beam can move a little bit, but it shouldn't crumble and break like plus like cement or lime wood Finally, every nut and bolt in the eye beam. The top is back filled with this adhesive plaster and it looks a bit messy, but once it's dry, it'll scrape straight off the eye beam. There's locking nuts and I put thread lock on so I can trim all these bolt ends down now. Once all that's set. God, it's been a mission to do this bit for some reason. Anyway, cutting the joist is where well, it's a half indoor job. It's at least downstairs where it's not pouring with rain. So I can get all them cut tomorrow and I can get them all in. I can get them all noggined, which I know you're all looking forward to. Now the wood for the roof is ordered and it's arrived. It just needs picking up. And that's all structural grade Douglas fir. It's different from the wood I've been using from the floor joist. It's had to be a more beefy structural grade wood 
So that's all arrived. So I'm just waiting on, just waiting on me. One thing I wanted to mention is, some of you might have seen already, but Chateau de Chaumont is appearing on British TV on Channel 4 on Help We Bought a Village. So if you can get English TV or, you know, you can do that magical thing where you work around it, do that. I think we're on the 6th, 7th and 8th of November. They've been filming alongside us. So it's, well, it's really projects you've already seen, but it's more from their point of view. So it could be good. Check that out. And I will see you for noggins, floor joists, and, well, just general fun tomorrow. <sighs>